Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today's video is called, Is This Pistol Still Relevant? I'm thinking about making this a series. I have a lot of handguns out there. Some people may consider are still very relevant. Other people, that's irrelevant. And we're going to check it out today. This will be the first one and hopefully we can make this a weekly series. We'll see how well this is performing. However, I want your feedback. And when I get your feedback, I'd like more than just a one word answer. Like, no! Or, yeah, it's fine. You know, explain why. Why you feel the way you do. So what are we talking about? The first one, is this pistol still relevant? And we're talking about the CZP-10M. They launched it a little over a year ago. It's CZ's smallest in-production pistol. It was the Rami until they made that out of limited production. And now I think it's just gone. The 2075 Rami, love that handgun. So, so happy I have my hand on it. But anyhow, this is the P10M, and it steps away from the P10 series quite a bit. First, it comes with a staggered stack, single feed round magazine. They do give you two, and the trigger is very different. Now, it has a 3.2 inch barrel, a pick rail there, not a bad feeling handgun, not a bad shooting handgun. My, like most CZs, the slide is like glass, but the trigger has a trigger bar safety in there. But there's also another safety, I believe, because when people pocket carry, which so many people do, you'd be shocked. I, I get feedback all the time. I read all the comments, by the way. And people say, I just pocket carry, especially in those states where it gets so hot. But it has a seven pound trigger pull right there with the reset fairly short okay now when this was first launched the msrp was a little over four hundred dollars they dropped it so i don't think this is doing very well for cz to 2.99 so is it is it selling is it relevant if we look at the p10m and we compare it with what so many people wanted CZ to do, and that's come up with a double stack subcompact 9mm. They may be working on it now, I don't know. But here's a SIG P365, and if we look at the barrel length, we'll see that it's about a half inch longer with the P10M. The But the capacity, this is currently holding 12 and this is holding 7. So we see a five round difference in favor of the P365. And this also has night sights. Now, this is still a $500 gun. This is $299. So we have to consider the price. But the heavier trigger pull, I do believe it's a safety Many manufacturers keep their smaller handguns that they believe people will pocket carry as a little heavier trigger pull. If you don't wear a pocket holster when you pocket carry, you are really, you've got guts, okay? You've got big ones because you really should do that. It, it should just be standard. So many people pocket carry though. So I don't think CZ sold a ton of these i think people had high expectations for something like this and they did not deliver at this time but they did came come out with the cz p10m now at first it was only available overseas and then all of a sudden it made its way here i don't think a lot of people bought it it is completely snag free there is no slide stop on there so so may consider that an advantage even the sights a little little ledge there with the front sight but it's snag free for pocket carry but once the slides lock back you have to drop the mag and manually move the slide back to that position so it's a little bit of an issue another thing is that it has this pin right there all right that has to be popped out of this side to disassemble the pistol so basically what you do is you just move it back a little bit, push it through, and it just protruded just a little bit there. Do you see that? Right there, it protruded. And then I can pull it out or just get a punch and punch it out. I'll go ahead and push it back in. But that's how you disassemble the pistol. It has a very simple design and very nice 
fit and finish, which is consistent with CZ. Is this pistol still relevant to you? Do you own it? Do you love it? It shoots nice. I will say that. That part's consistent with CZ. But the overall style of the handgun, seven round mags, is that too low for you in today's world? Or do you still feel that the uh, lower capacity magazines are okay? Let me give you my thoughts. I I think a lot of people still pocket carry. I know it. It's a fact. I get a lot of comments. People say, I still pocket carry. So, in my estimation, it is relevant. Is it a hot seller? I don't think so. I don't think so at all. I think when CZ comes out with the double stack subcompacts, very similar to this, that would be fine. Just a little more capacity, then that will be a much better seller than this. And we'll just see what the future holds, but maybe we'll make this into a series. We'll see how well this video does. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.